Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Sofia. I'm a makeup artist and I do tutorials on my channel, so subscribe to my channel. And today I decided to recreate my look that I did for Instagram, as you can see. So I'll show you how I achieve this makeup look with glossy lids. For this makeup, I use palette from ColourPop. This is one of my favorite palettes from ColourPop love it so much and yep yeah, let's get started <laughs> I always start my makeup with primer. I will do glowy skin as you can see. <coughs> Ooh. So as you can see for this makeup look I did glowy skin. <laughs> I'm gonna use this primer from Herborean. This is Bamboo Glow Cream. Apply it with my fingers. It's amazing base for makeup. For foundation, I'm going to use from Guerlain because this foundation gives me beautiful glow. Okay, now let's apply concealer. I want to use a full coverage concealer from L'Oreal Infallible Concealer. Just apply it underneath my eyes. Also hide some pimples. Now let's do brows. So. Uh, I want to fill my brows with this pomade in uh, Ash Brown. This one from Focalio. This is Chinese brand, which I really like. So I also have a shadow palette from this brand and the quality of that shadows are so amazing. If you want to try something new, then you should try products from this brand. Usually I use powder bronzer, but today I wanna use some creamy textures and I have this contouring palette from Essence, which I love. I'm gonna apply this darker shade on my cheekbones. And then I'm going to take a lighter shade and apply it here. For blush, I also want to use creamy blush and I have from Colourpop, wait a second. I have this Styx blush in Cool It. This blush is perfect for everyday makeup. Let me know in the comments of which products do you prefer, uh, creamy or powder. And I think we got a lot of glow, so let's apply just a little bit powder. So I'm using Fit Me powder from Maybelline. 
just a little bit right here and here much better let's do eye makeup before it i want to say that you have to understand that gloss lids is not suitable for everyday makeups and uh, it will be perfect for photo shoot or photo for instagram you know because of the gloss the shadows are quickly raw as i said i'm gonna use this palette from colourpop love it so much guys i'm gonna start off by using these shadows I'm going to start off from the outer corner and apply here. As you can see, I don't put shadows on the center of the leads because we'll see what I'm going to put on the center of the lid. Oh, I'm taking clean brush and I'm gonna blend these shadows I'm going to apply just a little bit of these dark blue shadows just here now I'm taking white concealer from Makeup Revolution and I'm going to apply it on the center of the lid now let's apply these shadows called aquamarine on this area taking this brush and blend this and I want to add more dark blue shadows Okay, now I'm gonna apply mascara for lashes. For mascara, I'm gonna use this one from Essence. Ooh, guys, I forgot about lower lash line. Oops, I also wanna use these shadows. Also, I'm going to apply this blue pencil into my waterline. And I can continue to apply mascara. For lashes, I'm going to use these drama lashes. So now I'm gonna do my lips. Firstly, I wanna use this pencil from MAC. And for lipstick, also from MAC. This is powder case lipstick in Mulletover, also with peachy tone because 
I really liked how it looks. I mean, blue shadows with peachy lipstick. And I wanna add some contour. So guys, it's time for gloss and I'm gonna use this blue gloss. Just put it on my hand. And now apply this gloss with the brush that I used for concealer. I'm gonna start from the center of the lid. I really love gloss on the lids. What do you think, guys? It's perfect. One moment. Woo. Guys, this is the final look. This is my ocean fantasy makeup look. What do you think about this makeup? And also, let me know which recreation would you like to see next. Just check out my Instagram and let me know in the comments. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and give this video a thumbs up. See ya in the next videos!